How is it going, Facebook? How's it going? What's up? What's up, Facebook? It is Dave Simney. I'm coming to you live. Excited to be here today to come to you live on Facebook. This is pretty, pretty awesome to be here. Um, I love how the little uh, subtitles never get my last name right, but I'm excited to save you some money today. I'm going to talk to you about collagen. I'm going to give you the real shocking truth. Um, look, I've been in the collagen industry now for 12 years before I even really knew what collagen was. Um, I've given over a thousand presentations on collagen. And obviously I have a business marketing collagen. That's my disclaimer. I'm also not a doctor, not a medical professional, um, but I've given over a thousand presentations all over the world. I've presented to doctors and scientists and uh, medical professionals uh, at places like the A4M World Anti-Aging Conference. I've done an incredible amount of research. I've seen it all out there. And I'm here to share with you the shocking truth about collagen. There's things that you don't know, things you probably should know, um, things you may want to tag some people on and share this video, this live with some people that may be marketing toward uh, you directly with some crazy stuff out there. Um, it's hard to cut through the clutter, but I'm going to help break it down for you and find out, are you really just flushing your money down the drain. Look, we know the collagen market is massive. It's a almost $9 billion industry in 2021. Back when I started 2009, it was a hundreds of million dollar, in fact, a billion dollar industry. Um, so it has grown in a, in a, in a, in a decade, um, really by a billion dollars almost every single year. Um, and it's predicted to be uh, the exact same rate of growth, 9% or more. Uh, by 2028, it's going to be almost 17 billion. So it's going to more than double. Um, and so it's here to stay. Uh, you're going to see collagen becoming more and more um, commonplace as it is now. It seems like every every week there's a new company promoting collagen or some type of collagen. So let's cut through the clutter. Let me tell you what I've learned in my last 12 years um, about collagen. I want to help save you some money, uh, but also give you some very valuable information about um, trying to find out if a product is legit or not. So first thing we want to start with when we're talking about collagen specifically is the source. Where is it from? And, you know, most people don't know where their collagen comes from and they kind of don't want to know. Uh, but I'm here to give you some real shocking truth. Um, what you don't know is most collagen comes from cows and pigs or uh, the newest version or iteration uh, fish scales, or what I like to call fish juice, uh, which is completely not bioavailable or bioidentical to humans. So I don't know why, other than maybe getting some omegas um, that anyone would promote uh, any kind of a fish collagen. There's no clinical substantiation. There's no studies published in major medical journals, uh, but that's beside the point. So those of you marketing fish, uh, just stick to the ocean um, and leave your collagen at home, drop the zero, get with the hero. So that being said, Cows and pigs, let's talk about that. Um, by the way, there's no vegan collagen. Uh, you have collagen boosters like vitamin C, but if anybody tries to market vegan collagen to you, it's marketing hype. Your body uh, cannot, uh, you, know, you cannot get collagen from um, a plant. So there you go. I, I'm sorry, vegans. Um, and I totally get it if it's a moral thing or, or a health reason why, uh, but you can't get collagen from, from plants. So cows and pigs, uh, here's the, the shocking uh, reality. And um, Plug your ears if you're squeamish. Um, I can't believe to this day people are putting that in their bodies. So here's what happens. When you get collagen from its source, which is a cow or a pig, um, the marketing companies that market collagen go to the, the slaughterhouses. And in the slaughterhouses, uh, they take all the parts of the cows and pigs that they can't sell. So hooves, um, snouts, tails, hides, um, eyelids, trachea, um, if there's any growths, they cut those off. Um, the hides, all, all the parts, the anus, all the parts of the cows and pigs that can't be eaten or sold, and they put them on the cutting room floor. It's stuff that they're basically throwing away, and they repurpose it. They grind it into a powder, into a just this just gross emulsion of just disgustingness. Uh, it's not really vetted at all uh, through the FDA. Um, you have very little oversight when it comes to slaughterhouses. I'm, I'm sure a lot of you have seen the PETA videos where there's like those undercover footage 
Um, it's pretty disgusting. If a cow has like mad cow disease or something crazy, um, you know, the, F the FDA or, or, or some of the, the, the safety organizations, they may walk through once a year with a clipboard. Uh, but the reality is, is there's no oversight there. Uh, very little, if any, in the industry. That's why you've had people that get salmonella and all kinds of weird craziness. So think about the best, best, best parts of a cow and pig that go to like your bacon or your butchers or your, you know, you're going to buy your ribeye or whatever. Think about that and everything else that can't be consumed. They grind it up and they put it into a powder. And that powder is sold for pennies on the dollar to marketing companies that are not scientists. They're not formulators. They literally buy this collagen powder in bulk, right? And they put a fancy label on it and they say things like pasture raised. Like, I'm sorry, is there some organization that tells me what classifies, classifies as a pasture? Is a pasture eight by eight, four by four? Like who made the rule that what classifies as a pasture? Uh, okay, is it dirt? Is it grass? What is a pasture? But see the word pasture, it, 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 it makes you think of this beautiful rolling green hill and this cow roaming through the pasture. Um, so they use those marketing terms or my favorite grass fed. It's like, what else is a cow going to eat? So I'm glad that's all you have to say grass fed, pasture raised, but um, that's just marketing jargon. Uh, basically, they all come from the same source and they're all in these big slaughterhouses and they sell them for pennies on the dollar. And people put that in their bodies. Um, it's very, very scary. So um, unless you have a source that is single source, um, that is non-GMO, that is hormone free, and that is a byproduct, which would mean uh, they're not slaughtering um, the source for the specific collagen. Um, so I'll, I'll share with you the source that I've seen to be the best and that is proven to be the best. Um, but let's talk about that. So there's your cows and pigs. Furthermore, the cows and pigs are they're not bioidentical. So they're, they're not the closest thing to, let's say, human articular cartilage. The only thing that's the closest thing to human articular cartilage would be the chicken sternum, the very tip of the wishbone of the chicken. Um, and I'm not here to talk about um, that per se, but just to know that when it comes down to the actual composition, um, the single source collagen and hyaluronic acid matrix is the best source, non-GMO hormone free. Now, most collagen is just collagen. It's not hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid, you may have heard of. It's found in a lot of the injectables that they put um, to plump up people's skins or uh, skin um, and also in dermal you know, fillers, things like that. But there's also hyaluronic acid. Um, when people are bone on bone, they inject it uh, into their knees or their joints. So hyaluronic acid is found anywhere there's moisture in your body. And when you're talking about hyaluronic acid, it has to do with things like moisturizing your eyes, you know, with things like dry eyes. Uh, your voice, right? Your voice changes as you age. Uh, the levels of moisture in the follicles of your hair, your gingival health, right? Your gums, um, keeping those healthy and firm. All of these things are critical in addition to your joints to keep your body running. We're losing HA, hyaluronic acid, from the day we're born. So we're going from a plum to a prune as we age. So understanding the importance of hyaluronic acid, where most of these other collagens are just bovine, you know, collagen or cheap you know, porcine collagen, right? So having a collagen that is not just collagen, that's collagen, hyaluronic acid. Here's, here's the next thing, chondroitin sulfate, having a naturally occurring matrix of all these things. So you get type two, which is for your joints, but you also are stimulating types one and three. So this is the other big difference that people don't realize. And they just eat this stuff. They buy this stuff because it's cheap. They find it on Amazon or Worse, one of their friends or family like hears about it from some Facebook post or some Instagram story, and they automatically believe it, and they just buy it and they put it in their bodies. And you don't even know what you're putting in your body, quite frankly. Is it made in the USA? Where is it manufactured? Is it certified by three third-party auditors, NSF, CGMP, um, MPA compliance? Now, at the end, um, I'm going to share with you the source that that I use that that I've put my name and my brand and my entire reputation behind. Um, but first, we also want to talk about the molecular weight. So what does that mean? If I asked you, what's the molecular weight of your collagen? 999,000 out of a, you know, out of a million couldn't tell you, right? But when you look at molecular weight, it has to do with 
what's being absorbed by your body or is it passing right through? So many people are taking collagen that goes right out the other end, doesn't even absorb because the molecular weight is too big. You want the sweet spot to be 1.3 to 1.8 kilodaltons, right? 1.5 is kind of the average because if a molecule is too small, it won't absorb. If it's too big, it won't absorb. It's like trying to park a battleship in a garage. You're trying to shove a, a, a basketball through a chain link fence. That molecule is not getting through, but yet people spend thousands and thousands of dollars millions of dollars. It's a, it's a $8 billion industry currently, $9 billion industry on products that just, they're not meant to work. They're not working. Or better yet, the company can't do micro dosing. They can't do pure liquid. They have to do a powder. They have to do 10 grams of protein and 20 grams of this and that. They put fillers and junk in these things in order to, to make the claims that they can. Or the, my favorite, the multi-collagen like Ooh, let me grab a cow and a fish and a pig and everything else and chuck it in a blender. By the way, that doesn't work either. Um, so the other thing we talk about is bioavailability. First of all, if you're taking a, a, a collagen powder, good for you. You probably get a good deal on it. There's a reason you got a good deal on it. Okay, it's cheap. It costs pennies on the dollar um, and it doesn't absorb very well in your body. <clears throat> in fact, passes right through in oftentimes. So we talk about a liquid. The capillaries right under your tongue is the highest absorbable place in your entire body. So submucosal delivery and a liquid delivery system is key. Now, I think it's funny because a lot of the new companies now, we've been, we've been doing a liquid collagen since 2009. A lot of these companies are coming out saying, oh, we have a liquid. It's like, yay, you finally, it took you 10 years to figure out a liquid's better than a powder. Yay, I'm glad for you. But then they don't have the right source or they don't have hyaluronic acid or they're not hydrolyzed, right? Or they're not broken down to peptides your body can absorb. Or let me give you a really key difference in everything else out there. And there's no other product that does these two things. If a type two collagen stimulates types one and three, there's only one that's proven to do that. That's the one I represent. The other thing is there's an enzyme that breaks down hyaluronic acid in your body. It's part of the aging uh, process. It's called hyaluronidase and this product inhibits it. So again, there's no other product that's doing that. So we're talking about all these different products and collagens out there. It's important to understand getting the value out of your money, the delivery system in a liquid. Um, if you put it in an antioxidant formulation, you're helping support a healthy immune system, protecting your DNA, like a soldier, you wouldn't go into battle without armor. So it's important more than ever to have, you know, antioxidants. We all understand that. Um, also you want your collagen to taste good. Imagine that if your collagen tastes good, people stay on it. If they stay on it, they see results. If they see results, they're going to be on it for a long time. This is why so many more people are getting into the collagen space because they understand that collagen specifically, right, has benefits, but I'm here to educate. There's so many people not out there educating. They say, well, you know, there's people out there saying, well, collagen is just going to get dissolved in your stomach acid. To those people I ask, and, and I work with doctors and I work with medical professionals, I'll say, so tell me again how drinking calcium or drinking milk strengthens your bones. How does that work? So what happens is it goes right into the bloodstream and it increases the levels of HA in your bloodstream by 60 fold, right? 6,000%. And, and we've proven that time and time again with clinical studies. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's another great question. I think I'm on my third presentation today about collagen. So here I am live. You're catching the highlight reel. But what I'll share with you is this. Um, when you talk about um, a product working or not working, it's very important to understand that the placebo effect is, is actually a real thing. So some people do see results on the cheapo stuff, but it's proven that about 20% of people will experience a placebo effect um, just naturally. Doctors that I work with, they don't, they don't care you know, how a product works. They just want people to get better. If they know that it works and they feel that it works and there's tangible results that they're, they're getting better, great. But um, from my perspective, if you want to have a business that's around for five, 10, you know, 15 years, and we're in our 13th year now with a business that grows and grows and grows, we're now, you know, half a billion dollar business from literally zero. We're the pioneers in the college and space. If you want a business that has longevity, you have to have the product that works. I mean, it's, it's kind of a no brainer. Um, but the last thing I'll share is this. If you ask anybody what their collagen they're taking and you ask them, what's the source? What's the molecular weight and how many patents does this product have? How many clinical trials proven in medical journals, double-blind, randomized, placebo-controlled by third-party, you know, 
IRB approved CROs, clinical research organizations, give it to me. And they're going to be stopped in their tracks. They're not going to be able to provide that information. I, I promise you, like, bring it, bring it up. Send me a private message if, if you can tell me those things. And, and, then, and then you're going to ask, well, where's it manufactured? Where, where's the source? Where, where does it come from? Is it vertically integrated? Is the company, the manufacturer and formulator? Is it third of, certified by three third-party auditors, NSF, CGMP compliance, certified good manufacturing practices as set forth by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration? And in is, is it NPA, Natural Products Association? What certifications does it have? Does it have a version that's sugar-free, <clears throat> you know, no carbs, you know, no calories? What, tell me something more. And, and I think a lot of people, you know, we're all guilty of this. We fall for like marketing hype and, and, and Facebook stories and things like that. I'm here to tell you that there's really only one brand that I've decided to align with. Um, and again, I put my entire reputation on this, you know, prior in my entertainment career, I worked with people like Lauren Hill and Lady Gaga. And I worked for, you know, the Rolling Stones. I, you know, I toured with them. I, I worked for, you know, Ringo Starr and Billy Joel and Elton John. I've worked for, you know, Neil Diamond. I've worked for so many people and, and music brands in my life, helping other people <clears throat> build their businesses. So one of the things I realized, there's no substitute for quality. You know what I'm saying? If, if one of these musicians is looking for an actor or they're looking for a dancer, I'm sorry, or a musician, they're going to do an audition. I challenge you to audition your collagen. I challenge you to, to finish up the stuff you're using right now. And I challenge you to try mine for 90 days. I challenge you. And anyone that's watching this, if, if somebody tags you on this, this live, somebody tags you on this presentation, if someone shares this with you, get back to that person. You know, if you contact me and someone else referred you, I'll refer you out to them. But I want to challenge you to try this brand, the Collagen HA Matrix Technology. If you want more information, drop info below. I'll send you information. I have a private Facebook group of 31,000 people. Um, you know, sharing all the facts because you know facts are actually important the truth actually matters marketing people do that all day long um and I'm, I'm not here to knock any specific company or brand but i'm here to tell you right now there is no better source no better value than the liquid collagen he matrix technology and it's been around it's proven tens of millions of people it's the most awarded collagen i believe in the world it's the most researched collagen HA matrix in the world. Um, and there's, there's nothing better. So you can, you, know, you can throw your money away. You can flush it down the toilet. You can keep buying it because somebody says it's great. You can piggyback on your placebo effect for a month or two. Um, but after a certain amount of time, there's only one product you're going to want to be on for, for the lifespan of, of the rest of your life. And fortunately, we've got so many different ways to get the price down for you, rewarding loyalty, um, adding certain items to your cart that get the overall price down, things like free shipping. If you get eight items, there's all kinds of ways. Um, and, and actually this week, uh, we've got a 10% off site-wide, which is great uh, sale. There's always some type of, of sale to help you um, save at least $10 or more um, on getting started. There's a 30-day money-back guarantee. You have nothing to lose. So I want to encourage you to take the Collagen HA Matrix Challenge. Shoot me a message. Let me know. Um, if you have questions about whatever brands you're using, I'd love to see it. Shoot me a private message. I'll let you know. Is it, is it called, you know, is it bovine? Is it porcine? Is it fish juice? Is it, is it vegan? Right. And, and I'll put some facts in front of you and I'll drop you into my private group. Uh, those of you that want to just join on your own, you can as well. It's called the collagen matrix um, and get back to me. Um, let's keep it real. Let's, let's uh, educate the marketplace um, I know there's a lot of great noble people out there marketing their version. Um, but there's only one that's been around since 2009. That's been a pioneer in the marketplace. That's doing half a billion in sales. That's in 30 countries. That's had millions of people, billions of dosages sold. That sells a million bottles a month. There's no one can touch us. So I welcome all the competition. I'm not here to quote unquote compete with you, but I'm going to ask you some questions very directly to your face, to your DMs. And I'll, I'll ask these questions. And if you can't provide those answers, I'm sorry, I can't help you. I, I, I guarantee you, if I ask you 10 questions about your product, you're not going to be able to come back to me with, with any real valid answers. You can talk to your MLM leaders and friends and all those people. No, no dis, no disrespect, right? Facts are facts. 
Clinicals are clinicals. Proof is proof. And then once you get on this product, you'll see the difference. You'll feel the difference, right? I've had two torn meniscus. I've had all kinds of issues. You know, I've, I've, I've put on some extra pounds over the years. You know what I'm saying? I've had issues. And this product time and time again, it's helped with my hair. I mean, my hair is so full. My nails grow like crazy every single day. I had a big scar on my forehead that's virtually disappeared from a surfing accident. I mean, all these things are not just one-offs or coincidence or placebo. They're real. The real results. You'll see those in my page. So that's it, guys. I just wanted to share some real information. Keep it real. Don't flush your money down the drain. Let's make it count now more than ever. Thank you guys for watching. Share this with somebody. Hit the share button um, and tag somebody in this. Feel free to tag as many people as you want. Get back to the person that shared this with you. And thanks again for joining me. Have a great, great uh, rest of your day. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you so much.